Have you ever wondered how life begins? It all starts with a process called ovulation. This is a crucial part of the reproductive cycle in females. During ovulation, one of the ovaries releases a mature egg. This egg is not just any cell, but it's one of the largest cells in the human body, packed with genetic information and potential for new life. This egg then embarks on a journey, leaving the ovary and entering the fallopian tube. This journey is the starting point for a possible path towards fertilization. It's as if the egg is setting sail on a voyage, with the hope of meeting a worthy sailor, a sperm, to create a new life. So ovulation is more than just a biological process, it's the beginning of a fascinating journey, a dance between two cells that could potentially lead to the creation of a new individual. With the egg now in the fallopian tube, the next stage of this incredible journey begins. Now imagine trying to swim up a waterfall. That's similar to the journey sperm undertake after being deposited in the vagina during intercourse. This journey is nothing short of an epic adventure, filled with significant challenges and hurdles that only the strongest will overcome. Upon entering the vagina, the sperm faces its first obstacle, the acidic environment. This environment is hostile to sperm, and many do not survive. Despite this, the sperm continue their quest, determined to reach their ultimate destination. Their next challenge is navigating through the cervix, a narrow passage leading to the uterus. This passage is filled with thick mucus that acts as a barrier, preventing many sperm from progressing further. However, some sperm are able to penetrate this barrier and continue their journey into the uterus. Inside the uterus, the sperm face yet another challenge, the immune system. The female body sees the sperm as foreign invaders and unleashes white blood cells to attack them. Yet, even in the face of this attack, some sperm persevere, driven by their singular objective. Their final challenge awaits in the fallopian tubes. Here they must swim against the current, a feat that requires exceptional strength and stamina. Only the strongest and most determined sperm will make it this far. Against all odds, some sperm reach the fallopian tubes, where they may encounter the egg. This is the end of a long and arduous journey but also the beginning of a new one, as the fertilization process commences. The fallopian tube isn't just a conduit for the egg, it's the typical site of a life-changing encounter. Here, in this narrow passage, the sperm, having navigated the labyrinth of the female reproductive system, finally meets the egg. It's not an easy meeting though, the egg, like a fortress, is surrounded by a battalion of protective cells, known as the corona radiata. These cells serve as the egg's first line of defense, warding off the majority of the sperm. The sperm, however, are persistent. Using their tail-like structures, they propel themselves towards the egg, each hoping to be the one to breach the egg's defenses. In the end, only one lucky sperm, the strongest and most determined, succeeds in penetrating the egg's protective layer. This momentous event marks the culmination of the sperm's long journey. One lucky sperm penetrates the egg's protective layer, setting the stage for the next big step. The successful sperm doesn't just enter the egg, it merges with it. Just imagine, it's like two worlds colliding, two distinct entities becoming one. This fusion, this beautiful collision is the very essence of life's creation. As the sperm penetrates the protective layer of the egg, something wondrous happens. The genetic material of the sperm, carrying the father's unique characteristics, fuses with the genetic material of the egg, a bearer of the mother's traits. This fusion creates a single cell with a complete set of chromosomes. This single cell, this perfect blend of two individuals, is called a zygote. The zygote is the very beginning of a new life. It's like the first note in a symphony, the first stroke on a blank canvas, the first word in a novel, yet to be written. It's the first step in a journey that will lead to a unique individual, a person who has never existed before and will never exist again. But the zygote is not just the beginning, it's also a promise, a promise of potential and possibility. It's the blueprint for a human being, a map that lays out the path for development and growth. With the formation of the zygote, the next phase of this journey begins. This journey, this incredible voyage of life, continues with the rapid cell divisions that will eventually form a blastocyst, marking the early stages of pregnancy. And so, the cycle of life continues. From a single cell, a whole new life begins to form. The fertilized egg, now referred to as a zygote, embarks on its own journey, one that is as remarkable as it is intricate. The zygote, a tiny package of combined genetic material from both parents, undergoes a fascinating transformation. 
it starts to divide rapidly, splitting into two cells, then four, then eight, and so on. This process, known as mitosis, is a spectacle of nature, a dance of life at its most fundamental level. Each division brings the zygote one step closer to becoming a multicellular organism, a complex being formed from the simplest of beginnings. As the days pass, the dividing cells begin to form a hollow ball structure, now called a blastocyst. This blastocyst, still microscopic but growing, continues its journey, propelled by tiny hair-like structures within the fallopian tube. It's a race against time, a march towards a destination that will provide the necessary environment for further development. And then, the moment of truth arrives. The blastocyst, having traveled down the fallopian tube, reaches the uterus. It's here that it finds its new home, a nurturing environment where it can grow and develop. The blastocyst implants itself into the uterine lining, a process called implantation. This moment signifies the initiation of pregnancy, the start of a new chapter in the journey of life. The uterus, with its rich blood supply and protective walls, will provide the blastocyst with the nutrients and safety it needs to develop into an embryo, then a fetus, and eventually, a baby. It's an incredible transformation, one that occurs over approximately nine months and results in the creation of a whole new life. And so, the journey that began with a single sperm and a single egg results in the beginning of a new life. It's a testament to the wonder of biology, the miracle of reproduction, and the incredible journey that every one of us has taken to come into this world.